Sunshine Coast pub owners are against a push for licensed venues to close early, with new figures revealing we are the safest place in the state to go out. The local liquor record says there's been a 35% drop in alcohol-related crime. It was far from an alcohol-fueled crime-free weekend, with reports of two violent incidents involving glass at Nambour and Currumundi. But what's been the silver lining? Figures revealing the coast is officially the safest place to party. The police are telling us now that it's been over 12 months since there has been a glassing in licensed premises on the coast, which is good news. That's compared to 28 in Brisbane, 9 on the Gold Coast and 7 in Cairns. Mr Lolbach says the results correlate directly to the introduction of the liquor accord which began in 2007. Undeniable that in the time that they've existed there's been a 70% reduction in alcohol related crime in Mooloola Bar and a 35% reduction in alcohol related crime across the Sunshine Coast. It comes as doctors demand pubs and clubs closing times be wound back to 2am. You can't simply put a one stop measure out to solve all the problems. Thoughts echoed by Maruchidor Solba who say they shouldn't be punished. So we, we don't do any shots after 12, we don't do any specials with our drinks. Uh, at 2 o'clock we, we mellow our music right down. There's no other way. You, you have to be proactive. The LNP says they would consider reduced trading hours if they won government. People should be able to feel safe in their communities and safe in our streets. They should be able to go out and have a good time uh, without the threat of violence or being glassed. The 2am closing time has also been recommended by the Queensland Police Union. Sarah Owens, Win News.